I've found that the easiest way to start a fight is to talk about the cholesterol hypothesis and statins. So we're going to do that based on this review article from 2018. The article is a review of three review articles published in 2016 and 2017 that purport to state that the cholesterol hypothesis causing heart disease is indisputable and that statins are beneficial. So this group of researchers looked at 15 questions to see if that's true or not. The authors of this study are from around the world, Sweden, France, the United Kingdom, Japan, Italy, and the United States. None of them have financial ties to the pharmaceutical industry and three of them are independent researchers. They did a deep dive looking at the cholesterol hypothesis and the benefits of statins which have been on the market since 1987. And we're going to do a series about what they found and the questions they asked. This is video number one of a series looking at this paper. The first question they ask does high total cholesterol cause atherosclerosis or plaque buildup in coronary arteries? If high total cholesterol causes atherosclerosis, then those with high cholesterol should have more atherosclerosis than those with lower cholesterol levels. And way back in 1936, it was found that people with low cholesterol are just as atherogenic as those with high cholesterol. Since 1936, that has been confirmed by at least 12 different studies. If high total cholesterol causes atherosclerosis, then there should be an exposure response in cholesterol-lowering drug trials. In 16 cholesterol-lowering drug trials where angiography was performed, there was a response only in one patient, and the only treatment in that patient was exercise. There are 15 questions that they review in this review article, and we're gonna go through all of them over the next week or two. So stay tuned. All of these questions are things that everybody assumes is true, and they've proven not to be true. Have a great day. Come back and listen, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.